As we mentioned at the top of the half hour, Stephanie Jones, the mother accused of neglecting and abusing her eight year old son, Navin, who died last year, has taken a plea deal. And Lizzie Siles was in the courtroom during this hearing. She is now live for us to explain, Lizzie. Tyler and Amber, as we mentioned at the top of the hour here, uh, Stephanie Jones pled guilty to one of her counts. The other five will be dismissed as a part of that plea deal. Here are some other things we're learning from the courtroom here in regards to this deal. Uh, in exchange, Stephanie Jones cannot be given a life sentence, although in um, some pretty strong remarks to the court this afternoon, State's Attorney Jody, who's essentially asked the judge to give her a life sentence anyway, because of that one uh, count she pled guilty to, she's eligible for, for 20 to 100 years in prison. So uh, whether or not she gets an actual life sentence, she could still be sentenced to a number of years that would, in effect, be a life sentence anyway. Uh, as another part of the plea deal, she also must testify truthfully against her co-defendant, Brandon Walker, Navin's father, if she is called to the stand during his trial next week here. Now, we'll have some of those remarks from State's Attorney's Jody Hoos coming up at 10, but uh, her remarks prompted quite a few tears uh, from the members of the court gallery here as she described some of the conditions of Navin's room and his body, as well as detailing some of the abuse and neglect he endured as determined by pediatric doc doctors and uh, the coroner's office. We'll have those details for you coming up in a bit. Keep an eye on our website, 25newsnow.com, for the latest. At the Peoria County Courthouse, I'm Lizzie Siles.